Hello everyone. In the previous video, we learned how to make 3D model from the sequence of pictures. Photogrammetry always generates high poly with auto UV. We always need to make a low poly version of that object to work smoothly. When we make a low poly version of the same mesh, the UV is changed. And we need to transfer the base color of high poly to the low poly. So, Today let's learn how we can transfer the base color from high poly to low poly. We are going to do it in 3ds Max. There are loads of other tools, which can perform the same action easily. For now, let's start with the default tools in 3ds Max. I'll load the previous model in 3ds Max. For the low poly model, I'll just create a plane. Let's make it square, so that we can make it tileable later on. Place it aligned with the high poly, like this. I'm making it just to fit inside the high poly. Now, we need to add the texture to high poly that is generated with photogrammetry. Let's create a shader, and apply it to the high poly mesh. Select the low poly, go to rendering, render to texture. Here enable projection mapping. Click on pick. From the new open box, choose your high poly mesh and click add. In mapping coordinates, make sure to choose use existing channel and choose the UV channel in which your UV is in. In my case, the UV is in channel 1. Choose Diffuse Color in Target Map slot. Now, choose the texture size of your choice. I'll choose 4K size to export and choose the location and the file type to save the generated texture file. All set. Now, just click the render button. The base color is now being generated. It can take some time in relation with your mesh and the PC hardware you have. The texture is generated and is also applied to the low poly. We can check in the folder for the generated file. Here is my low poly texture. It's perfect. That much for today. Thanks for watching. And make sure to subscribe for more videos.